When I was in college, I had the opportunity to uh, work at some neighboring high schools teaching percussion and uh, around, uh, around Ada. And what I discovered is that how cool it was for these kids to have the same passion that I had. Uh, and also that you literally had the ability to change their mind and to cause them to learn. And I, I never really thought of it like that. And all of a sudden I see these kids growing and having passion for what, like I do, for music. And I just, that was just addicted at that point. Uh, it was, that's, I knew that that was what I was going to do. If they can see the passion that you have for music, um, that's addicting. And so I think you need to be yourself in front of kids and be real. And uh, they'll follow that. And I think that band is hard work and sometimes that makes it a hard sell. But fun is not a hard sell. And what they find out is the harder you work, the more fun you have. And then the cycle continues. And that's what's cool about what we do. I think that's what helps get kids involved. I think that people saw the impact that we're on the kids. The our nominations are through the school and uh, uh, we have band kids. We have a large number of band kids. That means a lot of these band kids are in their classrooms and they can see the passion those kids have. And I think um, that speaks to testaments to, I, I think that I was nominated as the head director here, but I'm part of a team of excellence, a team of teachers, a team of parents, and a team of students. And I think uh, that, uh, you know, being quote unquote the, the guy uh, the head director, the, uh, kind of the symbol of that. That being said, um, we have wonderful teachers. We have wonderful teachers we teach with, and we have wonderful kids, and we have wonderful parents. So uh, it's luck. I just happen to be the guy that uh, is a symbol of what's going on at the Southmore Band. If you want to get down about education, you can real quick. And it's really easy to just talk about the pay or the, the, the hours or whatever you want to talk about. And those things do need to be talked about, they do need to be discussed, they do need to be fixed. That being said, what makes a great teacher is to be able to look through all of that, push all that to the side. And remember that student in the classroom is the whole reason we came here. None of us came here for money. None of us, though I'll take some more, but none of us came here for money. That being said, we came here for the kid. And when your eyes on the kid and that kid growing and that kid uh, making great music or that kid becoming a great citizen or you get to watch that kid 10 years later and see what happened to them and see that maybe you played a little bit of a role in that, that's what makes a great teacher.